In 1984, John Snatter, a college student working at a local pizza pub, delivered his last campus pizza, picked up his business degree, and went home to Indiana. There, at the age of 22, he knocked down the broom closet in his father's tavern, installed an oven, and started selling his pizzas to the tavern's customers. Papa John's Pizza. Grew from one store to 46 stores in its first seven years, and then from 46 stores to 1,600 stores in next seven years. Today, there are more than 3,000 Papa John's outlets worldwide. Dear Toastmaster, fellow Toastmasters, and guests, just like John Snatter, there is an endless list of successful businessmen, wonderful sportsmen great musicians, awesome writers, and so on, who have influenced the world by their achievement. Experts spend a lot of time trying to figure out what makes people successful. They often look at people's intelligence, education, credentials, and other factors. But if you look at the life of successful leaders, you will find that they often don't meet normal credentials, normal mold. For example, more than 50% of all the CEOs of Fortune 500 companies had C or average in their college. Nearly 75% of US presidents were in the bottom half of the school classes. And more than 50% of all the millionaire entrepreneurs never finished the college. What made it possible for the people who might seem ordinary to achieve great things in life? What made them so successful? How they were able to stand themselves out from the crowd? Don't these questions pop up your mind? Answer is passion. They were passionate enough in what they were doing. They were so passionate, they were so enlightened that they changed the world. Next immediate question that may arise in your mind is how one can know exactly what his passion is. One may be passionate about many things. If you ask me, I'll ask the question right back to you. Is there something in your life for which you could spend hours of time without even looking at the clock? Is there anything which makes you feel good from within? Is there anything that reflects your true personality? It could be sports, music, photography, writing, technology, programming, accounting, teaching, or anything. I have passion of accounting and auditing and I enjoy it thoroughly. Next, after identifying your passion, next question that may arise in your mind is, can you nurture your passion or is it too late now? In my opinion, it's never too late to do something good. If you are a student, do a research before joining a course or a career and choose the one that allows you to make use of your passion at work. If you are a midlife worker who is not enjoying your work life, then think of enhancing your knowledge and skills in the area you are passionate about. I am sure down the line, eventually, you will start moving towards a better job. And if you think you are in the same job since a decade, and switch over is not possible, then try to convert your passion into your hobby and start enjoying living. Let me tell you four truths about passion. Number one, passion is the first step to achievement. Your desire determines your destiny. Stronger your passion, the greater the desire, the greater the potential. Number two, 
passion increases your will power it is fuel for your will if you want something badly enough you will find the passion to gain it number 3 passion changes you if you follow your passion you cannot help becoming a more dedicated more productive person number 4 passion makes the impossible possible human beings are so made that if something fires the soul impossibilities vanish those masters how to increase your passion you can recollect your childhood days and try to recapture your old enthusiasm or if there is no fire you can associate with some fire lighters who can help you building in your passion those fire lighters are like contagious disease if you are staying with passionate people they will contaminate you with passion so those masters what are you waiting for ask yourselves what you want retrospect for your life try to gain your passion and lead a wonderful life thank you